Well, this is my American Edelstahl Unimat SL100. I got it at a garage sale. I paid 20 bucks for it. It was in terrible condition. Nothing moved. I cleaned it up as best I could with, you know, that pitting's deep. If I was ever gonna wanna restore it or anything, I'd have to replace those. But it is what it is. It's a combination lathe, mill, saw, drill press, just miniature. It's uh, got the original motor. I had to replace the cord, mice ate it. And it's a it's a nightmare i'm telling you if you have to change a cord on one of these things you'll find out and it came with the box for the accessories i have the three jaw universal lathe chuck mounted i've got the quarter inch drill chuck on it the face plate i had it i don't know where it went it's gone grinding wheel arbor Right there, slotted screw adapter, I guess probably that's it. I got the Allen wrench, I got the, one of the dead centers, feed lever. I had the original mill plate, but that walked off, so I made my own. It works pretty good. You know, this thing is so drastically underpowered. It, it, it's, it's laughable. I mean, it's fun to play with brass with it. And what pathetic uh, scales it has are in metric. And it's called, of course, a whole metric machine. It, it, it is not very accurate. But supposedly the man that bought this made this on it. I don't know if I believe it or not, but the owner swore up and down that her uncle built that anvil on this machine. And, eh, I don't know. There's the tool holder, dead center. Couple of counter sinks, one uh, pilot drill, a couple of drill bits. Came with these tools. It'll fit. You can put that big bit in that holder. I got four of these miniature mills. There's one in it. There's the hold down and the drum sander and the, the dog. But it's just, it's just, a, you know, you're not gonna make anything on it, nothing of any importance. Um, my brother had a bunch of small parts he needed to modify and it was completely not up to the task. I've never done anything with it. I'm uh, making a little cannon, I guess. I got a bunch of this brass at a yard sale. Thought I'd play with it, but that's what that is. The Unimat SL100. I believe that's the model number. There's the, the tag on it. So if I ever get anything made on it, I'll do a video. Thanks.